What is going on guys the rap dude back at you with a brand new video and I am excited to bring to you a brand new series the reason why I'm doing this is because checking out the new hottest rap songs doesn't get updated a lot you know what I mean and I kind of kind of getting tired of reacting to mainstream people but I'm not gonna say that I'm not gonna do it again but for this video I'm just going to be checking out hottest new albums I think I want to call it I think I'm gonna call it that. checking out the hottest new albums not hottest maybe just checking out new albums I don't, I don't know I'll come up with something but res big dog respecter.net love this site if it wasn't for this site when none of my when search for hidden rap gems wouldn't exist this wouldn't exist but we are in the july of 2020 archive and we are about to check out some brand new albums bro. you know what i mean because like i'm searching for hidden rap gems i'm still in the 2012 archive and i do be getting a lot of music on there from 2012 and it sounds like it's from 2012 so for this series let's go ahead and check out some just new shit man new artists old artists can be in here too mm, it's not necessarily people i've never heard of just anybody so that's not gonna be a restriction with all that being said let's go ahead and get right into it man larry june guest appearance 2021 he says 2021 on here i guess it's this stuff that he's been featured on i guess never heard of larry june kind of look like joiner lucas mixed with slim fuck let's check it out man i'm excited man let's check it out man hopefully i find some bangers this must be brand 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 new shit let's just check out private valet from four days ago let me see if he got the album on uh, That particular album, I think, is not. Got a, got a nice amount of music. All right, hopefully, Larry June is dope. Got a, got a uh, A Ball MJG uh, um, paid homage to A Ball MJG right there. Let's just check out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check out something that's on here. All right, let's go to this. So let's check out this. Uh, Oh, this is a conglomerate. So is this dude, I I guess he's a producer. Cause I see Currency, Snoop Dogg got some songs on here. Let's check it out, man. I'm, I'm thinking that this is from 2021. Okay. Let's check out Wonders. Yeah, this is from 2021, but it, it's still, you know, it's still kind of, you know, I, I still do. Why is a piece of fruit right here in front of these niggas? Wonders? I guess that's supposed to mean something? I don't know. Nigga, this shit going crazy. So I'm guessing, I'm guessing, I'm guessing he's a producer. This shit wrong, bro. Hey, bro, this shit wrong. God, that nigga, hey, that shit cold. Hold on. Make that shit back. Niggas always wanna try us till it's wrist match. Ugh. That nigga got bars too. Damn, G. Hey, hey, cuz. I'm liking this series already, man. Ha <laughs> ha Okay, this dude 
rapping, man. He, bro, 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 bro. The energy, the energy on the track just left because I know he coming with like the nonchalant flow, like, yeah, niggas want to hand line it hard. But, the, but the, but the, I guess it was two dudes rapping in the beginning. They came with some energy, bro. I feel like the song should have ended like when them two dudes because come on, man, why you gotta come with? Why you gotta come with the sleepy flow, bro? The shit was so hype, Nas. Nigga, what the fuck you wanna do? Nigga, I fucking around and shoot. Like, all right, man, come on. And what were those background vocals? What was that? Rap don't work, send a bitch park 55. Trap don't work, got a hundred thousand to the side. Come on, bro. How to ruin the song one on one. Come on, man. <laughs> this shit was so hard in the beginning, bro. And this shit, this, 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 this dude come on with the weird shit in the background. Man, that would have been a perfect song if that the last dude, bro, you killed this. Man, why would you, bro, I thought I had a new banger, bro. Oh, why would you? Why would you kill the song like that? This shit was so hype, man. I'm getting lit. This nigga come in, just ruined the shit, bro. Why does that happen? <laughs> but um, like I said, bro, I think I, he, he's a, he got to be a producer. But that was fire. Let's check out. Black Sea was happening, and I'm and I'm guessing he's a West Coast. I don't know, bro. I, I don't know. I don't know. Um, and we got a music video. All right, bro. Can we can, can this be some fire, bro? I just look like him. Off the clutch, disrespect little nigga, then it's up, then it's up. Off top, all right. This right here, off top. Oh man, not bad, but generic, 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 generic. I, I see that. I hear the um, you know, nice instrumental, real West Coast. I see, you got the San Francisco on. Oh, uh, generic, generic. Shame, man. That last track that would have sold me, but uh, man, wow. Let's see if the next dude do something different. If not, got some metal in a stick, box of ammo in a drum. I ain't starting no shit, but won't finish till it's done. Yeah, man. And I'm gonna do it just like I do searching for hidden rap gems. You're only gonna get two shots. Uh, really not interested in listening to the rest. But, uh, I mean, it is what it is, man. That first track fumbled the motherfucking bag, brother. Alchemist, Russian roulette. I'm gonna check out everything. Alchemist got some new shit. Oh, that's from 20. Oh, I forgot about. I forgot. Uh, I forgot that Respecta.net do this. Most of this, a lot of this stuff is not necessarily from 20, 2022. I'm tripping. They will. They will throw some old stuff in the archive. So I'm glad that I caught that. See this Raekwon. That's 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 old. Okay, here goes some 2022 shit right here. So we're so so I'm just gonna do stuff that's 2020 2022. Um, I don't even know how to pronounce this. He got Camille in there and two chains on the track on the um features. Toby Noah. <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> Hopefully it's some fire, but yeah. Anything that's old, I'ma just. This dude performing on BET? Where is... Uh, no, 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 no. 
Where is the where is the album at? Oh, I think I seen this dude before. And like a I never I never listened to him though, so that's the good thing. So Oh, it's like an EP. Round here, part one. Okay. Oh, I I was on it. I'm tripping. Okay, let's let's check it out. Expecting this nigga to be so hype, bro. <laughs> that nigga can't. I was not expecting that, bro. I was expecting like some, cause like looking at it, bro, it's, it's like some, it's like some peaceful looking shit, like some, like some. Oh, my nigga finna be rapping about some, you know what I'm saying? Coming up in the young world. That nigga came in, uh, 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 nigga, what, bitch? Hey, nigga, let's go, cause that shit was going crazy. I don't care about no hoes, nigga. Hey, hey. Oh, I'm getting, um, I'm getting, I'm getting Death Grips vibes. I have heard some of that, but overall, it's not my type, it's not my type of music, but I'm getting, like, Death Grips vibes, but I'm rocking with this, bro. Death Grips is, Death Grips is more experimental than this. Like, they be doing a whole lot of experimental shit, too. He just, this is just, like, some hype shit. That nigga, that nigga, bro, that nigga, that was, that nigga came in with the choir, y'all, bro, that was cold, that nigga, like, the chorus was, like, infused with a choir, bro, that All right, my dude has okay. He already showcasing different styles. He got the hype shit, and now he just coming in with some flow bar for bar shit. He dope, bro. I can already tell he raw. This shit raw, cause I like that. I like I like that switch up right there. I'm getting now. I'm getting outcast vibes. He's like he kind of like an Andre 3000 type flow. Wow, bro, dope, dope. Nigga, that shit, that shit was fire as hell, bro. I need to make a playlist. I need to make a playlist for like the new songs. I might as well go ahead and listen. Yeah, man, probably listen to part two. Hell yeah, I might as well listen to the whole damn thing. Okay, cause it ain't it ain't that long. Then he got a then he got a song the song with two chains and Camille in there. I gotta listen to that. Wow, four hundred thousand views. Okay, bro, let's get it, man. Now it's a singer. I want to know if this woman right here is like maybe his wife or something. Oh, shit. Damn, how the hell did that happen? Bro. What the fuck? But I want to know if this woman right here is like maybe his wife or something. These are his kids. She going crazy. She like singing, doing some melodic shit. It's going crazy. It's very unique, man. I, I love unique creative stuff. 
I always commend artists on being creative. Even though if I don't like them, I will still commend you for being creative and different. So, like, he already got a dub right off back for being creative. But this shit is going crazy. RP John with a spoon, bang bang. Hey, this dude is raw. He raw, bro. That's that's raw, kid. I like how the choir is infused into the song too. The the first is this song is two two parts too. Like the singing, now he rapping. He on some he like, he rap kind of like you know very very what's the word I'm looking for um very like you know educational and look I'm not no violent I'm not a violent dude but hey man if you, if you take it there that's how I am you know what I'm saying like you, you fucking with me then I'm a it's it's gonna be some problems you feel me but yeah man I'm liking he's like sophisticated. You know what I mean? But at the same time, he hype, you know, and... Pretty as planet season, my baby mother was told if you love a couple, marry her and don't use rubbers. Build a generation of some strong black mother. My baby mother said if you love a couple, marry her and don't use rubbers. Ah! <laughs> Boy got some bars, man. Real shit. <laughs> All right, let's see the next track. Chameleon there. I already like I already like this song, bro. I've been broke all my life, not the money right. Hey man, I'm gonna get there too, man. I've been broke all my life, not the money right. Hey man, inspirational shit, bro. Hey, I'm finna get there too, cuz. Real shit. You hear me, cuz? I, I, my, I, my G. I, I still don't know how to pronounce his name. Toby something. All right, Toby. Real shit, man. Look at that crib. I don't know if I would want a house that big. That's a big ass house. I do want, I do, I would like a house with a lot of room and space in it though, but I don't know if I want one that fucking big. I don't know, man. You never know. Shit. Yeah, that shit. But yeah, I think that's his girl, his, his, his wife or something. That boy cold, bro. He didn't, I didn't heard. I think I didn't heard like different rap style, three different rap styles from this dude. Hype on some outcast singing, and you know now he kind of got the like the new ways flow with the yeah, hey, yeah, hey. You know what I'm saying? Wow, brother. That's four. I said three. Hey, I like this series. This is a major dub right here. We ain't even got the chameleon there. Two chains. I don't know who Fat is. Hey, man, you don't even need them niggas, bro. He don't even need. He he, one of them artists that don't need features, bro. You just need to be him and his. I think that like him and his gal. Like that's it, bro. That's all you need. Fuck the features, cuz. But I understand why they put features on there. In the arm, 
Alabama. I ain't going back to being broke no more. Ain't shrimp, they shit for the pole dance. <laughs> my hey, that's one thing I've always said about Two Chains. He kills his features, bro. He kills his features, but his but his but his main music is like, yeah. That nigga came in with them bars. Oh yeah, Camille now that nigga hella he's like an investor now, so that nigga definitely ain't broke. Ace Town Texan, always be investing, coming through dripping and so Yeah, he just said it, Ace Town Texan, always be investing. Alright, nigga. I ain't seen Camille in there rapping in hellas, bro. This nigga then brought this nigga then brought Camille in there off the slums, cuz yeah. Could have been a one hit wonder. You should wonder why I ain't in the situation y'all in. Come here and I always had them lyrics, bro. Man. I guess fat is the is the girl. Okay. That nigga is fire, bro. Hey man. Toby, bro. Wow, cuh. Right, can he said Chamin Camille there came right on retirement and picked right where he left off. Gift of lyrics his body just fire, my nigga. I gotta check out more from you. That's a major dub right there. Major dubs, bro. Wow. I like that. I gotta I'm make sure I like it. So I'm gonna I'm I'm put that whole EP in my um. I gotta go to my um. Let me let me do this right quick. Cause I I didn't fell in love with YouTube music, bro. Amazon Premium. I mean Amazon. I said Amazon Premium. YouTube Premium is a must. So let me just go ahead and go to this guy. That's him right there. Oh no 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 no. Cause I can add his uh. Albums. Yeah, that one right. No, no, no. Yeah. Add that to the library. All right. Click the like on them shits. Yes, sir. Yeah, YouTube music is is, is fire. Okay, we got to do one more. Y'all right, we got to do three. That was a major dub right there. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Oh damn! It went. I went back to searching for hidden rap gems. Uh, damn! I got so much music I need to listen to. Okay. Um. This says this says year twenty twenty one twenty twenty two. Is that Tyler? I thought that that ain't Tyler the Creator, bro. <laughs> I thought that that's that, that, Tyler the Creator. Okay. A A I J K major black to the old school. Hmm. I haven't been able to find like these. Uh, let me see, please. Come on. Going black to Cali. Okay, here we go the whole. Okay, we got the music video right here. What is this? Okay, this is some underground shit. Pink. I like. I like underground. I like underground. Brand new stuff. Okay, let's check out uh, a. A. Uh, I, I don't know, but AIJ and Kane Major going black to Cali. Like is the milk that does the body good of a hottie. You can spot me in Hollywood. Quick 
the draw, McGraw hit the shawl, watch yourself, Mr. Call, crash dummy, you hit the wall, no place to visit and all, they got it twisted. This dude rapping like this, <laughs> that boy, I, they, they old school, nigga, that nigga, that nigga said, I ain't changing my style, nigga, I don't care. I ain't changing my style for nobody. That nigga literally rapping like it's 1984, nigga. Come on, man. <laughs> hey, man, I ain't try. I ain't rapping like these young boys. I don't care how old I am. I ain't rapping like these young niggas. Are. No, I ain't changing. We hip hop, the hip it, the hip it to the hip, hip hop. It. Don't stop. Look at that, nigga. <laughs> no, bro. Hey, man. Yeah, man. This is in like. Don't get me wrong, I love old school hip hop, but it is a particular old school hip hop that I don't like. And it's that whole run DMC super, super old school flow like Kumo D. I, just, I don't I don't like how those dudes rapped. You know what I'm saying? I just I just never could get into that. That old school. You know what I'm saying? But uh Yeah, man. He like it's like he's like a mixture of a mixture of that type of hip hop and like on some like Rakim. Now I do rock with Rakim. Like Rakim came with came with the you know I'm glad that nigga came around because that killed all of that Run DMC flow. So it's kind of like a mixture of um you know that 1980 when Run DMC come out like 83 like in 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 some Rakim. Yeah. I don't know, bro. Nah, bro. <laughs> hey, keep doing what you're doing, though, brother. But uh, you, this ain't in the playlist. Nah, nah. All right, we got to do one more. I always got to do two. You no, know, just to, just to, no more music videos. Uh, let's go to um, Sweat the Techniques. Look at the album cover. It Was that him when he was younger? Black to the old school. This shit crazy. Let's see. Sweat the Techniques. <laughs> Oh, what the? Oh, damn. Came major. Yeah. From the cradle to the grave. Grave from the cradle. Remotely controlled, but with blades to on the tables. LL Troop suits and 86 cables. 87 cents and fell in the creative thing. Heard the message in 83 with my fam and Pete Long. Fitted them on the fittest to prolong. Gotta be strong, I'll be gone. Feel All right, man. Definitely not getting added to the playlist, but I will recommend them if you're. If you were old head and you and you love like Run DMC and all that shit, check these boys out. They might be might be your cup of tea. But for me, no sir. But man, this series is finna be amazing. And unlike checking out the hottest new rap songs, I can I will never run out of stuff. Because Respecta.net, they always, you know, updating they shit. Always. So like I got hella more shit. So yeah, man. Um, this was a good video. Found a major dub. My boy, um, Toby, fire. But yeah, man. With all that being said, I'm gonna catch you guys on the next one. The rap dude signing out. What is going on, guys? The rap dude back at you with a brand new video. And right about now, I'm about to go ahead and continue the checking out the new rap song series. My G's. What I'm going to start doing for this, I know, like, Respecta.net, they always update their archives, but within their archives, they also put a lot of old music in there, too. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just, I'm going to just react to it all, bro. Why not? New and old, but I'm gonna, but I'm going to still have the title newest rap songs, but it's still going to be new to me. So, man, forget all that talking, man, without any further ado. Look, bro, Onyx.
got a new album, World Take Over. I'm going to be perfectly honest with y'all, bro. I'm not a big Onyx listener. I haven't, I can safely say that I haven't fully listened to a whole album. I do like tracks like Last Days and Slam. And uh, I think that's about it. I ain't going to lie. Not saying like they whack or anything like that, but I just never really like sat down and just listened to their catalog. But they got a 2022 album out right now called World Takeover. So man, let's just go ahead and check out some tracks. You know what I'm saying? All right. So let me let me just go to their YouTube page. Go to their playlist. I don't. Do they got any new music videos? They do. Shoot with. Let me see if that's one of the tracks off for of the album. Let me see. It is not. Uh, I would love to see a video. I guess they don't have any like that is new though. But I want it to be something off of the album. Man, do they got the album posted? This probably like just came out. I ain't even supposed to know about it. Let's just type in Onyx Stay the fuck out the way. I know that they make a lot of like hype music, crunk shit. Damn, this shit ain't... Okay, it's on various artists. This shit ain't even out yet, I don't think. Let's go. Let's check it out. The beat is raw as hell. The first dude that rapped on the song, I don't think that it's Sticky Fingers or Fredro Star. It was like a dude speaking Spanish or something like that. Now, although I can notice that the flow went hard in the Spanish dude, but I never can really listen to rap music where I can't understand what they saying. And he did say the N-word. That shit was crazy. Like, I ain't got no problem with it, but, you know, is what it is but i mean he had a nice flow or whatever beat going crazy i like the little um chant in the beginning they did the whole la da 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 day the da 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 day you know what i'm saying definitely some shit that i rock to i ain't gonna lie i think sticky fingers is finna spit next so let's go ahead and see what he talking about All right, uh, Sticky Fingers and Fred Joe Star doing a little back and forth thing. I really do like their rap style. It's kind of like real raw and rugged. On top of that, it's like with hella energy. I'm not, I'm not making this comparison to like the great Onyx, but it do kind of remind me of like Six Nine with the yelling and shit. Like Six Nine stitches, like that yelling type rap. Even Lil White. Maybe those are better comparisons than six nine, but they 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 they, they kind of yelling and this raw and rugged on top of that. Plus they coming with bars. Yeah, man, I probably might have to you know one day just sit down and listen to their catalog because Last Days is a fire ass song. That's my shit, and I'm starting to I'm kind of getting like vibes from that track within this track because they are talking about like the state of the world right now. And how fucked up it is. You know, it's, it's kind of reminiscent to that song. But like I said, beat go crazy. I like their rap style. It's very unique. I might have to check out this whole project because I, I'm messing with this song. Alright man, that was a pretty good track right there. I'm going to go ahead and click the like. Like I said, I, I think that this ain't even can't. I would say it's damn, bro. It releases September 9th. It's the eighth. It's about to release right now. Hey, damn, respected.net, bro. They be on it, cuz. But yeah, seven views. 
But hey, man, look, that's the beauty of this site. So let's go ahead and check out the second track. And this is a, this second track is about to determine if I'm going to listen to this entire project. I'm pretty sure they ain't going to let me down. Okay. Let's go ahead and see. I like, I like that their tracks are short. Two minutes, 50 seconds. I like that. Say what you got to say and just get on up out of there. Okay, for the most part, they got like short tracks. All right, let's get into it, man. all right um is there like a new member of onyx because they got the same like hispanic dude on this track too um i love these instrumentals are freaking amazing but i don't know man this 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 Hispanic dude that's come that they keep coming in he apalico hapalipalapalico sapicalaco I mean I guess it's I guess it's cool but like it's really not for me I would rather just hear Fredro and Sticky Fingers Sticky Fingers rap the first half and then the Hispanic dude came on a, I mean like I said I I I can't really listen to uh rappers that I don't understand what they're saying. Not saying like he probably saying some shit I ain't going to rock with, but I just like hearing, you know, understanding what I'm hearing, getting a sense of understanding of what I'm hearing. But I think this is like a a, a new member of them or some shit. I don't know, man. I mean, I don't rock. I ain't rocking with it. Like I said, I'd rather just hear the original members. He was cool on the first track, but to, to, to then come on this track too, I think they got like a new member or some shit. I don't know, man. I don't know. Time out. Time out. Hey, these beats go crazy, but uh, Sticky Fingers, I like his rap style, bro. Like I, like I said, I never really. You know, paid attention to Onyx, Sticky Fingers, and Fredro Star, but his rap style is really, really unique, bro. It's real, like, sinister. On top of that, it all is, 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 is very unorthodox, but it's unorthodox and he can, like, rhyme his words perfectly. That's crazy. That's kind of like an ODB. He, I like that type of shit, bro. That's, that's real unique. But, um, I'm gonna say this, man. Like I said, I don't know if the Hispanic dude is, is, maybe he just on these two songs, but if he on the whole project, I, I, I don't know if I'm gonna rock with it, man. Because, like I said, I'd rather just hear those two. It, it kind of feels like it's out of place a little bit. But, I mean, it's just my opinion, you know. These instrumentals are fire, though. Listen to this, bro. Like, that shit. That shit. Yeah. 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 Coming through with the bazooka, niggas already know how off the hookah, nigga. Do I smoke too? Nah, let me say that. I don't wanna disrespect that lady, nigga. It's that nigga GB running up on niggas coming out your TV screen. Fuck you mean? Put your head in the guillotine, run up on your ass while I'm eating Krispy Kreme. <laughs> hey, how <laughs> that be fire though? <laughs> Hey, man. <laughs> Out of chill. All right, man. Let's go ahead and just go over to the next one. Uh, Like I said, if that Hispanic dude on that whole project, I don't know. Sabic Red from Nonfiction. I do, Ill Bill, that is my guy. Slain, that is my guy. I have her. Yeah, he, yeah, he, he rapped with Necro. And uh, cause he got he got that one album when he got the ski mask on. So I, I'm definitely familiar with Sabic Red. I think I'm saying his name right. Ill Bill, that's my dude, bro. Really, really raw. So we got a new album from Sabic Red, Psychological Records, Goon Music. Very, very familiar. I'm a huge Necro and Ill Bill listener. Like them boys is raw. 
the ritual trailer oh yeah I, I do remember seeing this so I think this is another thing that isn't out yet um because I don't see it I see I mean I mean if, I, if the song don't pop up I guess we can just watch the trailer like respect to .net, y'all are official bro like this like this like look or maybe these are old songs maybe because the song is right here in this 2012 revisited so maybe it's like just a uh, it's not giving me like a description. It's probably it's probably a compilation of old music. Yeah, I think it's a compilation of like old because it's because it's, the songs are popping up. So you know, let's just go ahead and watch the trailer. Oh, I'm tripping. The ritual. This is this right here. All right, let's go ahead and just watch the trailer. Maybe we'll get a little bit more insight. On what's going on? Mr. John Fuentes, another round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Man, that boy was on. If this curfew goes through, the officials have just declared war with every young person in New York City, and that's how I feel. This nigga was on. What's that, Jimmy Jones? Bill Bill, that's my guy. You can be accepted for being who you are without. Yeah, my man was on TV. And that's the first way to start healing the process, mate. Hey, bro, no disrespect, bro. <laughs> but hey. He he kind of he, he kind of look like Eminem, cause okay? he look like Eminem, bro. I think like Eminem, bro. You can't tell me that boy don't look like Slim Shady, bro. And all white people looking like, <laughs> no, okay. The first way to start healing the process, May first, two thousand and six. Sabak right up in here supporting people trying to put an end to these immigration laws that are racist and unjust. All right now. Alright, so he's like I said, I've I don't think I've ever like listened to an album, but like I said, I do remember seeing his work being affiliated with Necro and Ill Bill. Real, real political. I know nonfiction was like a political um rap group. I did hear like what was that? The green, the green tape, fire. You know what I'm saying? Like so, yeah. He's like a political, fight for your rights type of rapper. I might have to check him out, man. I'm, 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 I'm sleeping old buddy, man. You know what I'm saying? Fuentes is a leader in that bridge building army. It's been a new day, a new era, new behavior patterns. We need to change the educational system. Yeah, man, real political dude, bro. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. One, two, three. Now y'all don't want Sabak Red and like what he's capable of doing on the microphone. Bill Bill. Alright, man. I like that little beat right there, but yeah, okay. Political, real political guy. The demigods, y'all heard of them. But yeah, man, um, I'm about to check him out, man. I never really. So let's just go ahead and listen to the commitment off of the revisited, the ritual revisited. Oh yeah, it's the same instrumental from the video, okay. The militant's back. I took time for transition. I made it past the decline of non-fiction I'm a warrior hunting for change Mainstream's overrated, main fuck the fame I'm for the people For more walks of life Specifically for people who are forced to fight You think I'm soft and light 
Cause I work with the youth Some of these kids I work with Be the first to shoot They iller than you In the street killing the blues I teach them one step at a time They fill in my shoes It's the rules of a leader Trouble and pain In pursuit of a teacher We struggled and gained We go from pimps to profits Liars to logic Sue to drug abuses Survivors of the projects My mind sets to clarity Predicting me well A sign past the tragedy Commitment to self I will Live my life for conscious I'll be the god amongst monsters I'll exercise more often I'll walk my talk and keep talking I will read more books But won't judge the cover based on how it looks I will, will Choose love not fear and make sure my commitment stays alive this year I will, will Choose to eat more healthy And won't believe everything you tell me I treat women with respect and be proactive and strive for the best I will, will Start to drink more water and not spend when I can't afford to Hey man, I am really, really rocking with this, bruh! This is some really, really positive, like, he making a commitment to himself to change, to be a better man, advocating for the youth, political, you know, it's, this is fire, and I love that instrumental, but buddy, he rhyming his words, you know, really, really well, flow is nice, yeah, man, I've been lacking on Buddy, bro, because it's crazy, because Necro, that dude is just death and sex. That's all he rap about, cuz, ain't nothing, but Necro is my guy, though. Ill Bill, he real political at times, too. He got the Illuminati 666 song, and the, um, the, the whole Kill Devil Hills was like a political, nine, uh, not nonfiction, like Coca Nostra. They real political. I'm an American and all of that, but okay, I see where it I see where it's all coming from. Like I said, nonfiction of green tape. So Sabic Red, I think he's just strictly that. No in between. Just strictly positive. Dude said I'ma eat. I'm I'm trying to eat right. Hey man, me too. Drink more water. I'm I'm you know me too, man. You know what I'm saying? Exercise and all that. Gotta get my mind making the commitment that I'm gonna change for the best. That I'm gonna change for the best. Yeah, man, I'm rocking with that message. I can I can get beside this. And like I said, put the positive message plus dope instrumental, dope flow, dope rhymes. It's a 10 out of 10, man. I'll make my message clear and make sure my commitment goes past this year. I will, will. of the risk we became better people life is a movie i'ma change a sequel we owe it to ourselves evolve better hell even for my folks behind bars in a cell stay well it's still a challenge reflect upon greatness embrace it to your balance ultimate awareness comes through when you seek the truth see life is a journey plans and patience know that you're worthy transformation manifestation of creation as we know it rhetoric redundant abomination of culprits life they've given you is all subliminal now we must commit and take back our principles turn hate to satisfaction anger into action greed into giving and passive into passion i will live my life for god all right man dope 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 fire 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 her two verses love the chorus i'm gonna go ahead and hit the like like i said I, I love everything about it from the message to the rhymes everything but let's go ahead and hear another track i asked children cry uh death death and destiny okay all right let's go ahead and hear track two Here's for my Brooklyn crew Put your hands up, show the world how we do For Europe, Africa, the US too Put your hands up, show the world what you do South America, Asia, Canada crew Put your hands up, show the world how you do PLR over Howie, all my goons Put your hands up 
This is for my militant movies, young he hustlers, rebels in America, the streets gon' love it. My throwback cats rockin' 40 belows, skull caps in the summer, cop the 40s of gold. Gold fronts from the Chinatown, off a canal, still they bootlegs run and get lost in the crowd. To my people overseas, reppin' real hip hop, come to shows, buy CDs, drink till they drop. To be Daddy Kane, rock camp, G rap fans, army gear, Jordan wearing 20 sack in hand. To the political prisoners who await release, to the cynical system, train your fake police. The streets are ready for war, we've been trained for years When the time is right, we gon' put away them fears It's the universal law, move below the sun My world army's in a war, so where you from? This one Alright man, like I said man, I've I, I been, I been sleeping on my boy Savage Red bro This track, again, another amazing track I'm loving the energy in this one Um, The instrumental is really, really, really good Like I said, he's a rapper that I could just kick back and just listen to he flowing his he flowing his words so nicely. The bars is hidden. So man, yeah man, I'm gonna definitely check out this whole project, man. Like I said, it's like he's political, but he's not like super political. Like I do like that. Like he 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 is touching on like the corrupt government and all of that stuff, but he's not like I don't know, man. He's he's not like it's not pretentious. Like some of these niggas is, man. You know what I'm saying? He, you, you can tell that it's real genuine and it's real, real authentic to him. So, yeah, man. Let me go ahead and just let the rest of it play out. This is a banger, too. I'm going to go ahead and check out this whole album. Yeah! Here's for my Brooklyn crew. Put your hands up. Show the world how we do. For Europe, Africa, the U.S. too. Put your hands up. Show the world what you do. South America, Asia, Canada crew. Put your hands up. Show the world how you do. Be a law over how we all my goons. Put your hands up. Yo, where's Brooklyn at? Where's Brooklyn at? Shit, Brooklyn everywhere. We done took the map. Okay. To my West Coast comrades marching the streets. To my left folks beyond that mark of the beast. The South American money making raw drug sellers who give back to the people who are pouring the favelas. To my peacekeeping soldiers who are out in the fall. Protecting women from the rapes they've encountered thus far. It's for my positive and negative. Balanced motherfuckers getting drunk and higher managed to so challenge one another. This is for my peoples all over the globe. All my folks who resist when we overexpose. We're not hoes for your clones. We pimp the system. Keep your fascist ideals, your empty vision, a social revolution. The people take charge. If we fuck it up, at least the mistakes is ours. This one here is for my Brooklyn crew. Put your hands up, show the world how we do. For Europe, Africa, the US too. Put your hands up, show the world what you do. South America, Asia, Canada crew. Put your hands up, show the world how you do. Be a law over how we all my goons. Put your hands up. Yeah, put your hands up, nigga. What you wanna do? I run up on your ass in a phantom, like Danny. I motherfucking hit up your granny. Hit her with a mammy jammy. I ain't fucking playing. I'm the black Ku Klux Klan. Hey, Danny! Let's stop, man. Oh, nigga. All right, I right, got my nigga Necro. That's my shit too. Your head split. Hey man. All right, bro. Yeah, Necro, that's my guy, man. All that. But, man, Sabic Red, G. Sabic Red. I'm going to have to go only 1,000 views on that, bro. Yeah, I got 16K right here. Man, that's underrated, bro. But, yeah, man, I'm going to go ahead and listen to that whole album. I love the two tracks. I love the fact that he's positive and political at the same time. I already know we gotta do three. Okay, this is R&B, but she bad. Oh God, damn, the fuck is Ari Lennox? Oh Lord, look at all that. Oh. Girl, let me tell you something now. Age, sex, and location. Hey, look, nigga like me. I beat the dust on that pussy. Nigga, let me stop playing, bro. My nigga Smoke Dizzle, nigga. Smoke Dizzle with a new album. This is my dude, bro. Hey. Hey, man. Look, bro. Dizzle. That's my guy, bro. The ringside EPs, come. Man, y'all already know I got a guy. Man, man. Dizzle go crazy, bro. This ain't even fair, bro. But yeah, man. 
I'm gonna go ahead and listen to my nigga Smoke Dizzy. Got Keith Murray and Black Rob, man, Mario. Dizza, okay? It's my dude, bro. He raw. George Kush for breakfast. Yeah, this shit ain't even... Okay, there we go. This shit ain't even out yet, bro. When this come out? <laughs> this come out. Uh, This ain't out yet, neither. But let's go ahead and type in Spit Them Bars, my boy Smoke Dizzle. Man, y'all gotta... Bro, you bro, you gotta give it up for respect.net. Bro, they... Bro, they... Bro, they put music on any minute. Ain't even now yet, cuz! That's what's up, bro. Unlike YouTube with they whack ass... What that shit called? On me podcast, bro, get that shit out of it. I said podcast. <laughs> hey, new smoke Dizza, man. Let's get it, bro. Dizza. I get what he's saying, but that was that was that was pause. This ain't smoke this. The, the the sound of this track sound like sound like it came out like 2003 some shit. But buddy said. Listen, listen, bro. What would he say? Cop suck is a gift. He ain't busy. His hands just full cause he holding my dick. I don't know, bro. <laughs> His hands just full cause he holding my dick. I guess I get what he's saying. Like, I don't know, bro. Nah, nigga. <laughs> this is, bro. Who is this nigga, bro? And <laughs> Angelus. And like I said, bro, this 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 beat sound like this track came out of like like oh three. Like some just blaze. Shout out to my nigga just blaze though. He wrote. But yeah, man. What? Okay, I got a feeling like this, 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 um, this album right here is basically like him, like, putting on rappers from New York. He did another project like this called RFC, but that shit was hard, though. That was crazy. That song right there, that's not getting any plays in the ride, dog. They ain't getting no plays in the ride at all, bro. Like I said, man, it sound kind of out, it sound real, real outdated, bro. Uh, that's, that's not necessarily a bad thing because I, I mean, I don't think I've, I don't think I've listened to artists that rapped on like outdated instrumentals, but I don't know. I guess you got to be able to do it right. That shit was just no plays in the ride, but, um, I'm getting the feeling that's what this kind of is. You know, I want to hear Dizza. I don't want to hear all these other niggas because, because, because like I said, smoke Dizza go, that nigga wrong, bro. Okay, the best around. See, this shit ain't even out yet, bro. Let me see. See, he got a part one. Damn, it ain't even popping up, cuz. See, <laughs> respect the dot net, bro. Official. Okay, there we go. All right, man, is this gonna be on this one, cuz? You know, you know what this is. You know what this is reminding me of. This is reminding me of like when those battle rappers try to rap. This is what this is reminding me of. <laughs> like battle rappers, y'all niggas just need to stick to battling. Dude, probably not even a battle rapper, but that's the vibe that I'm getting. You know when you know when battle rappers try to rap, you be like, uh, nah, nigga, stick to battle rap. <laughs> Smoke Dizzle, man, you still my guy, but uh, this ain't getting no, this ain't getting no plays in the whip, G. Not at all, man. I guess I, I guess I might as well just let 
the rest of it. I'll, I'll let it play for another minute. This has to be like a compilation of like old music because the second dude that rap was Smoke Dizzle, but it didn't sound like him. It sounded it didn't sound like him, bro. It really didn't, but it it was him. It sounded like it was like a younger version of him or some shit because like he like the style that's the st the rap style that's on this song is like the bar for bar type rap. And he usually don't, I mean, he do bar for bar rap, but it's real. But Smoke Dizza, he kind of, it's kind of like swag. It's kind of like hella, hella swaggy, bro. Let me see if I can go to a track. But that sounded like, it may have been like, some like old shit. It's gotta be, bro. It can't, it can't see like, see like, it's, it's, it's real like laid back. That's kind of like how his style is. Them Harlem niggas get it poppin', that's the realest drop. More than my nigga fresh. <laughs> But that's but that's like that's gotta be like him. This this has to be like him, like you know what I'm saying. We, he, you know his style got better and better and better because I like the laid back, I smoke, I like that vibe. Can't really rock with the whole bar for bar, but I guess we gotta start from somewhere, man. You know what I mean? Those got these gotta be yeah yeah Jack and Jack and for Beast ninety four yeah these are like old songs. Gotta be bro. We got a song with Keith Murray. You know what? Although I didn't like those two songs, I might just check out the rest of this because I do I do fuck with Smoke Dizzle. So it's gotta be something it's gotta be something on this project that I like. So um yeah man, you know I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up for that video, man. This is another episode of checking out new Damn new rap songs. This series is gonna be amazing too, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like I like the idea of finding new music. Like, bro, Respect the Dynamic literally uploading shit that ain't even out yet. <laughs> that shit is amazing, bro. That's crazy. Shout out to Respect the Dynamic, bro. Without this site, none of this would be possible. I got to, bro. I got to give y'all, y'all flowers, bro. But I've been using this site ever since, like, 08. So, man, like, y'all, bro. I, yeah, man. Shout out to Respect the Dynamic, man. But y'all already know what it is, man. I'm going to keep it going. More, 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 more this and searching for hidden rap jam. So, man, just stay tuned, man. The Rap Dude signing out. What's going on, guys? The Rap Dude back at you with another episode of checking out new rap songs. I am back at it again. I'm finna get back to it. Respect.net. What do you have in store for me today, man? Yeah. Let's just go ahead and get right into it, man. Forget all that talking, cuz. And we already have Sapa the Great, As Above, So Below. I see a whole bunch of features. J Joey Badass, Denzel Curry. You know, all the names that I know. So I'm guessing that this is like a compilation type of album. Let's go ahead and just check it out, bro. I'm pretty sure Respected.net then put something else on their site that ain't out yet. Shout out to them. They fired for that, except for the great. We got a live stream release party. Is this a is this a woman? Probably not. Alright, let's 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 uh go to let's just go. I like I like listening to you know, track one. Shadows. It's gonna pop up. I think this is a woman. See how she see how she looks, you got the Amy. Man, she like a. Hold on, I, I don't know. Oh, cut, oh shit! Oh, oh shit! Got a little brown skin. Goddamn oh, oh, me! Ha <laughs> Let me chill, <laughs> Let me chill, girl. Hey man, I love the ladies, man. One hour ago, bro. Let's fucking go, nigga. Let's see if she got them bars. Bro, 
this is like this is like that. <laughs> I, I honestly, bro, she's she's very very fucking like experimental. First, it started off on some like African Black Panther. Now it's kind of like on some like I got you in a trance type of. Sh- it's it's working because I am in a trance. <laughs> She done switched up her style probably about, like, four times. Because at first I was like, she, she, she kind of sound too much like Doja Cat. But now, it's, she has switched it up so much. Like, it's just like, wow, bro. I'm really, really digging the creativity. That's, that's, that is raw, bro. We need, we need more female rappers like this instead of rapping about shaking their ass every damn five seconds. This is, I can rock with this, bro. Like, I don't, I, I don't, like, like, I would have to keep listening to it because, like, this, like, this, I don't know if it's, like, the first half or the second half or the third half, but whatever half this is, I'm liking it. I'm liking this, like, this, like, trance-like type of vibe she got going on right now. I would have to continue to listen to it to see if I could, like, add it to my playlist. But so far, I'm rocking with the creativity. I know in the last video I said I really can't vibe to people that I don't understand what they're saying, but past the third half of the song, it was just again it was it was still in that like trance like state, but she was speaking a different language. I don't know what she's talking about. She I think I'm guessing that she's African. Um, but like I said, although I said in the last video. That I can't really rock with, you know what I'm saying? People who speak a different language. I can rock with her. Because uh, that shit was sounding real. Like I said, she 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 got me in the trance, bro, with that voice, man. I couldn't even, I couldn't even, cap, God damn, man, I was in this motherfucker like. She back her like a loco. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, yeah, hello, hello, hello. Look at that. Hey, man, I'm going to go ahead and hit the like on that. Like I said, man, very, very creative. That was, that was, that was, I see she meditating. That's definitely some meditation shit. I can, I'm rocking with it though, bro. I'm rocking with it. All right, man. That's a dub right there. Now we got a song with Denzel. So much life. Ooh. So much oh. freedom. Oh, 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 baby, baby, baby. Got them tender yams back there, man. Let me stop, bro. Let me stop. Cause she fucking around put a spell on the nigga, but I think she did. Had a nigga in the train. All right, girl. Look, 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 look. Now, look. See? See a nigga like me. Goddamn me. I'll fuck around and hey, hey, you know what I'm saying, girl? Look. Break your back around this motherfucker, nigga. Hey, let me check. <laughs> let me chill, okay? All right, man, let me chill, bro. Let me chill, let me chill man. Okay, um, the first half of this song was a continuation of the first song that we listened to. Um, it's it's so crazy because she she don't she didn't even she's not even like rapping. She's just talking. She's not she's not talking in a she's not talking in a different language. She was talking in English that time. But like I said, she does it in a way where it puts you in a trance and you just you you just you gotta listen to what she's saying. I like that. I could definitely like put that in the background, like when I'm doing like I don't know, nigga, writing notes or some shit. Like 
you know what I'm saying? I'm liking the I'm liking the I'm liking the vibe that this is bringing. It's 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 it's, it's like it's like messing with my chakras. You know, I'm, it really is, bro. Like, hey, bro, let me chill. Like, this shit is crazy. Like, <laughs> I want to see y'all, cuz. She on some voodoo shit, bro. <laughs> hey, cuz, hey, for real, though. I ain't even lying, bro. But, all right, I guess we finna start. I guess we finna hear some music. Because I did see Denzel Curry. some music and this shit is raw bro it's raw it's raw it's raw bro it's so it's so funny because like <laughs> she was she was like putting you in the trance the whole time and just like coming with these eloquent poems she threw some ratchet shit in there she was like pussy make a nigga stay she literally said that shit i, I wouldn't expect her to say nothing like that pussy make a nigga stay Put a nigga in his place. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I thought you was on some spiritual shit. I guess that is. I guess that will classify as spiritual, I guess. I don't know. Because uh, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure her shit is. Fuck around. Put you in your place, nigga. God damn. Nigga, hold on. Nigga, hold on. Stop playing with this shit. But yeah, man. Let me be for real, though. But uh, yeah. She dope, man. I'm definitely going to check out more. It's so crazy because it's like she it's it's, it's crazy because she, she barely like raps. It's mainly like her like doing because because within her verse she was still going back into like her poem, and I ain't have a problem with it. And Denzel Curry, I haven't I don't think I've ever listened to like anything from him. I probably listen I did listen to his first shit that Imperial. I remember listening to that back in the day. And it was, he's not a bad artist. He came on this bitch snapping. But, um, yeah, man, I might have to check some, I might have to check out his shit. Like, he's one of those artists that I didn't, like, sit down and listen to their catalog. You know what I'm saying? For me to really have an opinion on an artist fully, I would have to do that. But as far as Sampa the Great, Sampa, I think I'm saying it right, I'm listening to this, bruh. This is this is fire, bro. She 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 unique, bro. She's very very unique, creative, and that booty, that booty was. Let me stop, bro. <laughs> All right, man. That was fire. That was a dub. Sampa the Great. You got a fee a new female artist. I'm really really rocking with the vibes that she bringing. You know, spiritual on some like. Mixed with some like voodoo shit. I'm, I'm messing with it though. I'm messing with it. I'm gonna definitely check out the whole project. I got to. I really, really got to. Like I said, she in the first track she switched her style up about four times, and then and in the second song she came with another unique style that I don't I don't think I've heard before. You know she I don't think I've ever heard anybody rap like that. You know. But, uh, yeah, man, that was a dub right there. Shout out for that. Let's go ahead and move on to the next. My nigga Yeet. Nigga Yeet. Nigga Yeet. Yeet, bruh. If you don't know, uh, a couple streams ago, like like a couple months ago, a lot of people were spamming me to listen to Yeet in my uh chat. And when I did, bruh. I was rocking with it. So this boy got some new. This nigga got a new album cut. Featuring Lil Uzi Vert. No. But yeah, man. I did listen to one of his full albums. The What's it called? Up To Me. 
I like most of the songs on that bitch, bro. He's another rapper that's very unique, style very unique. People have, people do compare him to Lil Uzi Vert, but me personally, I don't see, I don't, like, I did listen to um one of Lil Uzi Vert's projects, The Love Is Rage, didn't like it. He do a lot of, yeah, 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 like, that shit is annoying. I don't, he probably don't do that no more, but when I heard that shit, I was like, bro, get your ass. But, um, ye fire though, bro, hey, ye go crazy, bro, look, man, I'm finna go ahead, hey, man, yeah, nigga, ha, <laughs> ha. Let's get it, cuz. One hour ago, niggas. Hey, bruh. Respected.net. Y'all on it, bro. All right, let's get it. Oh, okay. This is a, this is his official shit. Let's go, cuz. Yeet, nigga. Let's get it, cuz. Fucking beat, bruh. Hey, bruh. The song, okay. The song started off. I remember seeing that. I remember seeing that video back in the day. Dude, like, hey, man, money on my, money on my, money on my hat. That mean I got money on my mind. Money in my Kool Aid. That mean the money sweet. I do remember that. That was that was funny. But when the beat dropped, bruh, that nigga yeet. That nigga go crazy, bruh. That you can't, bro. The dude, the dude's flow is so good. And, and and like he and like his uses of his uses of auto tune is really good too. Uzi came on this bitch going crazy. I ain't gonna I can't even lie. He came on that bitch snapping, bro. And I think Yeet about to pick it back up. They doing like the um cause Yeet started off and then Uzi came on that nigga. Uzi came in snapping, bro. He came in on some melodic shit, but and then I, I I know Uzi got a good flow, but like I said, maybe it was just because of that one project that I listened to, where he was just ad libbing a lot. I, I couldn't stand that. Yeah, yeah. But right here, both of these niggas is going crazy, bro. <laughs> Real shit. Nigga, that shit was fire, bro. That shit, that shit was fire, cut. <laughs> That shit was fire flame, dog. Hey, man. Yeet, bro. Yeet, cuz. Yeet. He, he, he next, bro. He that guy, bro. He's fire. But Uzi surprised me. This dude, Uzi, came with... His flow was insane on this. Bars? He had bars, bro. Auto tune sounded good. Damn, maybe it's because of Yeet. He had to do. He had to go hard because Yeet was on that shit, nigga. You can't, nigga. You can't go, nigga. You can't come on the other way, nigga. That shit was raw though. So Yeet just brought the best out this nigga, man. Hey, man, I'm just keeping it real because when I hear the nigga on his own shit, I don't rock. Can't rock with it, bro. But right here. Both of these cats did they part. Now, this dude's instrumentals are amazing. Who who does his beats? I'm pretty sure somebody know. But uh, let's go ahead and check out the next song, Up Off X. Bro, 
this, I, 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 I gotta keep this dude, this dude, this, this dude's music is so good, bro. It is so good. It's, it's like, the, his, like, the beat just matches perfectly with what he's doing. Like, how can, it's like, it's like his, it's like his voice is also an instrument. You know what I'm saying? Like, this song literally went from like super duper chill, got hype, and then got back chill again, bro. That just shit is like, dude, 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 know what he doing, bro? Dude is wrong, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like the like I said, instrumental go crazy. I just, I just, I just like how he can incorporate his style of vocals with the instrumentals that he used, bro. It, it is, it is literally phenomenal. And when it comes to like auto tune, his version of auto tune is the is the version I like. He know he know how to melanize. He can rap. It's just, bro, he just called, bro. We need a month, bro. I'm and you know it's crazy because I'm never the person that'll be like, oh, these two need to do a song, bro. Like I'm never that dude. Either they do it or they don't. But I would love to hear Yeet and Chief, bro. Please, they gotta have it, bro. Chief and Yeet. Bro, they got to do a song, bro. They got to do something, bro. Chief Keith, bro, please. <laughs> that shit will go, go so crazy, bro. <laughs> I ain't going to cap, bro. They need to do a project together for real because Chief Keith, I put, I put, everything I just said about Yeet applies to Chief Keith. Because Chief, that nigga knows how to, he know how to, he know how to work a dope instrumental. In his favor. That nigga Chief got so many styles and flows. It is insane. Like real shit. The nigga. He, he, like all his projects sound different bro. Real shit. But uh. them They, they need to do something. Cause for real bro. For real nigga. That should have go crazy. Let me just let the rest of this rock out. Hey man, let me tell y'all something, bro. I'm you already know I'm listening to this whole thing, bro. Cause I like I said, I did fully listen to the um up to me. And I think I listened to one of his early projects. I bro, his music is really good, bro. Yeet is definitely that dude, bro. I rocks with him heavy. I got to hear this whole thing. But the, the track with him and Uzi, that shit was flawless, cuz that shit was. That shit was it was it was flawless, bro. That shit was crazy. The second song was just like a real vibe type track. It did get hype a little bit, but it's like a vibe. I like, he, he can make some vibe and like laid back shit. Yeah, bro. Yeet. He shitting on these niggas, bro. But okay, man, let's go ahead and do one more. We got another, we got another lady from Stone Throw Records. Natural Brown Prime Queen, let me see what you working with, that damn me. Hey man, look, bro. Oh shit. I see the little, I see that little, that little, that little swoop back there, nigga. Hey, hey man. But, but Stone Stone, that's atmosphere. Slug them. AR the Rugged Man, I think he on that label too. Damn. Got another. She she also look like she on some like trance like shit. That nigga yeet. Great, that nigga yeet, man. <laughs> that nigga yeet, that nigga, bro. But all right, let's go ahead and check out. All right, now. Nah. Oh, Lord, wait a minute. What we got going on? Sheesh. That's one of the songs on here. Oh, it's not. Oh, there it go. Natural Brown Prime Queen. All right, let's go to that. Say that for last. She on that look. Oh. Yeah, hold on, man. Let me stop the madness. Stop the madness, bro. With all these women on there, man. Look, man, y'all throwing me off. <laughs> all right, let's go ahead and listen to Homemaker. I'm 
I'm rocking with it already. Damn, pa pause it on there. But uh, I'm rocking with it, bro. I, it's, it's real, like, pop sounding. But her vocals are amazing. I love her vocals. She's singing really, really well. The chorus was extremely cra uh, catchy. I can be your homemaker. I'm rocking with it. This is something that I would definitely listen to. I, 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 I'm, um, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing she's a like singer and rapper. That's what I'm hoping. You know what I'm saying? But like, I do rock with, you know, her singing and it's like it's a real like pop sounding song. And I'm not really a big fan of pop, but um, it's got to sound good. Like that's that's the deciding factor. And this sounds great. really good it really is i like the second half it got it had like a little it had like a little a lead up like breakdown kind of thing and then it transitioned back to the chorus like extremely good her voice and just her vibe is amazing this is a gem right here bro like this this is crazy i like how she got these dudes in the laundry mat dancing all zesty I don't know. I don't like it like that. I just, I just think it's funny. I ain't, I ain't mean it like that, bro. Stop the madness, bro. It's funny. I know y'all niggas. Nah, nigga, I ain't mean it like that, nigga. I only like, I only like females only, nigga. Don't ever get it touched around this bitch. But yeah, man. <laughs> this is really, really good, bro. Definitely adding this to the playlist, bro. That was amazing. Really, really good. Really, really good song. Oh, man. Wow. That was amazing. I ha I'm dying to hear. Oh, this is the one where she ain't had no shirt on. God damn. Oh. Am I ready? Oh, where is it? Oh, it was called Natural Brown Queen. Oh, nigga, where that other one at, cuz? Oh, let me just type it in like this. Don't try to run. Nah, no, don't try to run. Don't try to run from the kid. I already saw you. Here we go, Nick. Oh, this the trailer. Shit, let's look, let's look at that dog. Look at that. There you go. Bro, her vocals are really, really good. She fine too, but damn, her vocals, her vocals are really good. I gotta hear the song. But yeah, I, right, I, right, gotta, I, right, the women taking over the, I, right, the women taking over the series. Okay, there go the video. Wow, damn. about this 
ask girls to die. She had a great big heart and a real big smile. Mama knocked on the door, go right up to tap. She said, my boyfriend think you can be a star. So we set her up in the pop duo with a twin sister, Catherine Parks. And it really didn't even work out like that. Got kicked out because she laid on her back. Well, that's how it seemed to her mommy and daddy. Crying on a boyfriend, they would never understand me. But all she want to do is watch Sailor Moon. So we just stare up at the moon. But let me let me let me start off by saying she's very very talented. She's really really good, bro. Like I said, cuz 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 the last song I want to know if she rapping. She definitely raps. Um but she it, it, it's 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 who do she I'm trying to think who she who could she remind me of, but she's like a really really cuz like I'm not a real I'm not like I said, I'm not a fan of pop music. But this shit is amazing because she got these like incredibly good vocals. And like I said, she switches it up. She was melanizing and rapping at the same time. And it all sounds, it all just sounds really, really good. And on top of that. Girl, look, hey, hey. <laughs> But yeah, man, I'm rocking with it, bro. This is definitely something. She's she's definitely a gem. Y'all need to y'all. Hey, for all y'all niggas complaining about the female rappers, all they rap about is ass and titties. Y'all need to y'all need to just search because there's some talented ones out there. It's two in this video alone, and I'm pretty sure it's a lot more out there. I've always have said this. Just, just take the time out, and if you, and if you, and if you truly want to find some good female artists, because a lot of y'all ain't even trying to look for y'all, just want to complain. If you just gonna complain, bro, just shut up, bro, because it's talented female artists out here, bro. They just don't have the views like Meg Thee Stallion and Cardi B, just like any other rapper or artist, just like any other artist. It's, it's so many talented people in the world, bro. It's not just the ones that they propped up. Stop that. She... <laughs> can't stop looking at this body, though. <laughs> what? Oh, look at this body, girl. Got the slim waist. Got the... Hey, man, let me chill, okay? Let me just play the rest. <laughs> let me play the rest of it. Oh, Always jiggling. It's Oh, it's jiggling, nigga. Hold on, okay. Hold on, okay. <laughs> nigga, la, nigga. Yeah, you already know what we gotta do. You already know what we gotta do. Oh, oh yeah. Ah, yes, sir. All right, man. Let me stop. Hey, chill, guy. Hey, chill, Because I'm hard to manage, doesn't mean I cannot have it. I just wanna see us lavish, bunch of niggas in some mansions. I can live in with some ratchet. All my exes got the madness, they missed out on my magic. Once I started wearing lashes, I threw away, it's a habit. Cause niggas are here showing rations, taking without ever asking. All you focus on is fashion. I wanna know how it functions. This me with all that fuck shit. Where the psychedelic drugs at? Always trying to do some fun shit. You know I make nothing of something. She's a hoe, that's assumptions. I just wanna have my titties out. Titties out, titties out. I just wanna have my titties out. Titties out, titties out. Titties out.
Okay, right here I'm getting Kanye Power vibes. This girl's vocals are extremely good. And like I said, her rapping is is really, really good too. She's very animated. I love people who can like be animated within their vocals. That's that's always been dope to me. Like a mystical a ODB. Like those dudes are real animated when they rap. And she's she's real animated when she sings and raps. Yeah, man, nothing but good things, bro. It's just, it's just, it's just, it's just really, really good, man. And I'm definitely listening to the whole thing. Shout outs to fucking Stone's Throw, bro. God damn. That was Fire Flame. This whole video, nothing but dubs, bro. Shout out to the new rappers. This, this Respect the Dinet is where we need to be. YouTube and y'all on everything playlist. Sit y'all ass down, bro. That shit is ass, nigga. I might go back to the on everything playlist and incorporate it with this one. But these songs in this video, nothing but dubs, all fire. I'm checking out all of these artists. Well, I already rock with Yeet. That's my nigga. But that's going to wrap it up for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. Finding new music. That's dope. It's always fun. So, yeah, man, I'm going to catch you guys on the next video. The Rap Dude signing out. What is going on, guys? The rap dude back at you with another banger. We are about to kick off checking out the new rap songs, the last video. Oh, it was so amazing. Oh, so much good music. Let's see if we can keep it going. All right, man, enough of all that talking, man. Let's just go ahead and get right into it. We got Black Soprano Family. Long live DJ K. Long live DJ Shay. Almost said DJ K Slay. Oh man, long live DJ Shay. Have no idea who that is, but we got some recognizable names. Benny the Butcher. Heard of him, but never really listened to him. West Side Gun is another one. I think I I think I did hear him and Conway the Machine on like some smoke dizzle tracks. Corey Guns. Never really listened to him. I know he was a member of Young Money. DJ Premier, Legend. Raekwon, Legend. Crazy Bone Joe. What? Look at you, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't going to do a joke, but like that, man. All right, 2022. Respect the dot net. Always hooking the boy up. Let's go ahead and see if we can just find the project and rock out to some tracks. Okay, this is definitely an intro track. Um, the instrumental is amazing. I hope that they don't waste this instrumental on the intro. Um, uh, I know there's West Side Gun talking, cause like I said, I have heard him on like some Smoke Dizzle songs, and people have always recommended me to listen to Griselda. Um, and I might, I might have to check him out. I might have to get around to it because it's just, it's so many artists and it's so much music. Like, I don't think, I don't think some, some of y'all understand that. Like, I can't just, you know, listen to, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's cause it's so much music. And I listen to so much music as it is. Like, I just, I listen to a lot of fucking underground shit. I'm trying to catch up on old underground music I never listened to. So, yeah, man, I, I don't know. This is three minutes and 20 seconds. We one minute in. I, like, I do like this version of an intro because it has a dope beat. You know what I'm saying? But he really just like shouting out people. 
But I hope I hope somebody rap on this shit, man, because it, 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 it'll be a waste, man. Come on. It's the, the track said it was featuring somebody, so somebody got to be rapping on it. I'm only giving headshots like a fat bitch on IG. Uh, <laughs> that nigga said I'm only giving headshots like a fat bitch on IG. Uh, nigga, that was a bar, bro. Uh, uh, well, somebody finally did come on and rap. I like. Uh, I, I was. I was hoping that, but that you know, I mean, dude who rapping right now. Fire, got them bars. I did notice that he said, fuck the ops, R.I.P. to Shay. So, um, did this dude get murdered? Damn, man. New York niggas got ops too, man. Everybody got ops, man. But, uh, that bar was crazy, nigga. That nigga, that shit was hard, God. I ain't gotta hear that again. I'm only giving headshots like a fat bitch on IG. <laughs> uh, that was notice me on my all right, man, from that, I'm going to go ahead and hit the like. Like I said, I can rock with that intro because the instrumental was dope. Um, I'm going to have to check these boys out because I do like they like. I do like these dudes flow. Shit is the shit is dope for like for like New York rappers. I'm pretty sure I've been sleeping on these guys, man. Pause no humble. But let's go ahead and listen to the second track. I'm so itchy, my brain is cursed. I became the big homie, breaking bread when my OG got changed. This is fire, bro. Instrumental going crazy. Like I said, I I rock with they rap style. It's it's real. You can tell these some like these some like these these the hood niggas. These the real like thorough hood dudes in New York. You can hear it in they dialect, and I'm rocking with it. And it's like they 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 they, they the like bar for bar rappers, but it's not too pretentious to the point where every single line has to like be a bar. You know what I'm saying? They they are they are. Most of the time, the last line is the bar, and I like that. I don't like, like, pretentious bar-for-bar bar rappers where everything has to be a fucking bar. Like, they do it in a way where it's not too pretentious. Um, fire, man, I'm going to really have to check these dudes out for real, bro. I got to get on that, because I already listened to Smoke Dizza. So it's like, I don't know why I ain't never really get around to listen to, like, Griselda and Conway and all them. I need, I need to get on that, man, because they fire, bro. I was somewhere in a trap, cozy, turn 8 to 24, thinking, rest in peace, Kobe. Alright, man, I'm going to have to check these dudes out, bro. You know, although the first song was an intro, I did like that. And then the dude rapping at the end, I like this track. So this is a dub right here. I'm going to go ahead and listen to this whole project. I'm going to also try to get into some, you know what I'm saying, you know, the rest of those guys. Because I do like their style of rap. But let's we can't listen to John Legend, man. That's 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 too R and B, man. This this is oh look at this nigga here, boy. <laughs> look at that nigga, boy. Boy, who the fuck you think you is, nigga? <laughs> look at that nigga, boy. Look at that nigga think he's sexy, ugly boy. Young boy, no, I don't want to listen to young boy. <laughs> All right, man. We got NBA young boy. I'm not the biggest fan of his music. I will admit that he do got some fire tracks, like that gangster shit. I like that. But, um, man, I guess I got to check it out, man. And I know this dude has a lot of fucking music. So he probably dropped, he probably dropped this and like, he probably dropped like two albums in the same month. But, uh, huh. All right, man. I'm not really, my, my, my hopes aren't high because on my, Checking out the hottest new rap song series, like, it seems like every album, not every album, 
Every song that I listened to from NBA Youngboy, I did not like. So, uh, let's go to playlists. I know the young boy fans finna go crazy, man. Y'all fan, y'all fanning over this dude is, is y'all weird. But uh, I see a fat booty in the thumbnail, so that's a plus. Put it on me. All right, young boy, man, what's up? What you got, nigga? Pussy on me, put it on me. Come and pull up on me, make sure that they don't. We gon' fuck from night to. Young boy. What you doing, cuz? <laughs> what, what was that move, cuz? What was that move you in, cuz? She won't put that. <laughs> ah, that boy. Hey, man, I ain't gonna. I ain't. Look, I don't have a problem with, like, dudes being zesty. So I don't wanna make it. I don't wanna make it seem like I got a problem with it. It's just funny. It's funny to me, bro. Like, like zesty dudes, it, it make me laugh. <laughs> That nigga, look at this nigga, bro. Hold on, girl. Y'all gotta see it. Put it on. Come and pull up on me. Make <laughs> what was that nigga doing, bro? <laughs> put it on. Come and pull up on me. Make sure that. Y'all gotta see it. Y'all gotta see it. Y'all This the gangster nigga, cuz. <laughs> oh, shit, bro. Oh, bro. <laughs> oh, shit. Bro. Oh, bro. This the gangster. This who the kids want to be, bro. <laughs> oh, that nigga, young boy, my head. Thug. That's what Thug's doing, <laughs> That just <laughs> that just threw the whole shit off. <laughs> oh, <bro>. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot stop laughing, bro. Stop laughing, bro. Stop laughing. Stop laughing. Stop. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Oh. <sighs> All right. Stop laughing. <laughs> Say I may. <laughs> Say I may. Oh, <laughs> All right. All right. All right. Listen to the song. Let's listen to the song, bro. Let's get back to business. Please don't do no more shit like that, man. <laughs> That's going to throw me off, cuz. From the strip. Bitch, through my whole life I had to fake my dirty guns. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> bro, it's see, bro, bro, the song, the song, I thought the song was supposed to be for for women. It's called Put It On Me. Every time he's it's like every time this nigga start rapping about like a girl putting it on him, he go he start talking about his ops and how he gonna kill him. <laughs> That nigga, nigga, I bust his head, hit his ass with that motherfucking K round. And we supposed to be talking about the women? Why are you talking about that? Why are you talking about niggas, bro? Every <laughs> time that nigga, all right, we finna, all right, girl, she got that ass. But when I see that pussy nigga, I'm a blast. What? <laughs> this nigga, bro. <laughs> this... That nigga, that nigga. That nigga can't even stay on topic, <laughs> bro. It's a, it's about the women, bro. Fucking need hoes, nigga. Like, nigga, it's like it's like he'll say one line about a female, and the next five lines is about how he gonna smoke his ops, <laughs> bro. But um, all right, bro. So, Cause that's why I was like, what, <laughs> nigga? What, what the, what the fuck? <laughs> But uh, um, I'm gonna be honest. 
I can understand the appeal of NBA Youngboy. I really can, but his his style of music is not something that I rock with because um for one, I don't like how he uses his auto tune. I don't like how his voice sounds in auto tune. Um, I don't know, bro. It's just it's, it, like his his music is just not for me overall. Like I said, he got some shit that I like, but that's not enough for me to be like rocking out to your music like yeet for example like yeet is just fire across the board but um nah bro it, like i said then like the subject matter of the song i thought it, I, I mean I, I thought it was supposed to be about women but it's about it's mainly about how you gonna kill the ops like what the fuck i mean like do what you want brother like i ain't nobody bro but uh Glad that nigga wasn't motherfucking rocking his hips. Imagine a nigga, <laughs> imagine a nigga rocking his hips and then rapping about shooting the ops. Even Lil Murder from P Valley don't do that, bro. Cause that boy, that boy, you know, he, 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 he gay, but he don't even be like, he, you, you wouldn't know it. You know what I'm saying? Like, he, he you look at the nigga, he a thug. Even he don't do the shit. But, uh, I don't know, man. I guess I'll let the rest of it rock. That ass look like you stank. But, uh, <laughs> this nigga, bro, the nigga literally, the, the chorus is, put that pussy on me. She said them niggas claim they gon' dumb me. What is, <laughs> what is it about, bro? Like, what? <laughs> you want the, so, so the girl you finna fuck is telling you, them niggas gon' kill you. <laughs> what is he, what is, what is, what is going on, bro? <laughs> I don't know, cuz, but, uh, that's not getting no plays in the ride at all. I guess I'll hit, I guess I'll start hitting the dislike on shit I don't fuck, but, um, I do not want to hear another song from this dude, but I have to because that's what the video is. Maybe I'll like the next track. Boot up. What is boot up about? Let me guess. How you gonna kill the ops? <laughs> nigga, bro. I'm not lying when I'm not now like now look like I said I don't have a problem with 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 dudes that are zesty I just think it's funny he literally he's literally like rapping it, it sound like it, it's y'all know how like zesty dudes talk when they be that's how he sound when he rapping <laughs> and like not even that is what's throwing me off because it's it's that and like his vocals are just it, it just sounds sloppy. He'll 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 say something and then it'll like sweet he'll like motherfuckers killing me. I don't even like that. Motherfucker hit me. I hit him. I don't what the fuck are you doing, bro? It's like it's like it's like random. And then the beat on top of that is like so generic. Like it sounds like all of his other beats. So like you got this. This, 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 this unorthodox rap style that don't sound good to me. Um, it sounds like, it, it literally sounds like a zesty dude that's arguing. Like, I don't even know how to imitate it, but y'all probably know what I'm talking. Y'all know when zesty niggas be arguing and shit. That's what it sounds like when he rap. <laughs> I'm sorry, but, uh, I gotta keep it real, bro. But, uh, yeah, man, Sh NBA young boy, bro, I'm, uh, I'm packing you up, bro. You, you, you got, yo, you, you gotta get packed up, G. Cause, cause, cause your rap style is, is, is just not for me, bro. It's really not, bro. It's, it, like I said, it's, 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 it's real sloppy. It's, I don't know what the fuck is going on in his vocals. The nigga be calm, hype, 
like one second later, nigga, like what, nigga? <laughs> like, I don't know, bro. It's just not for me, bro. So uh, we go ahead and pack that up. Oh, yeah, this like, um, okay. ASAP Rock and Homeboy Sandman. Okay, ASAP Rock heard of him, but I never listen. I think I listened to one of his albums. But it wasn't like I, it wasn't like I listened to it and was like you know, like I was focused. Um, I know a lot of people be saying like he like a lyrical demon and all that shit. I wouldn't know because I don't really because like I said I don't really listen to him like that. But this looks like a compilation of old songs. It says from 2015 to 2022. Oh, we got. All right, man, we go on here and check it out, man. You know, the album come kind of weird. But let's check it out and see if I rock with it. You be a young boy, bro. You got to go. Okay. Okay, rhy Rhyme Sayers. I think that's Atmosphere now. All right, let's listen to Vertigo. Okay, first impressions, not for me, not for me. These are real, like, these, this, that lyrical spiritual shit. <laughs> I don't like, I really don't like the lyrical spiritual shit. You can tell these dudes, I'm, I'm coming in with the slumberlin and I'm coming in rumbling, jumbling, humbling, pumbling, rumbling, cumbling, and, 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 and not really a fan of that type of hip hop. When it comes to like, like, Hip hop, hip hop. I like the shit. The you know, I like the nice flow, nice beat. You know, you're not trying to like you know rhyme every fucking word and shit. I mean, I mean, I'm not gonna say it is bad. It's just not for me. Just like that young boy. Uh, not for me, man. Um, uh, I see that a track on here was produced by my boy Charles Hamilton, and if that's the Charles Hamilton, that's one of my favorite rappers. Charles Hamilton is so amazing. And he does his own and he does he does his own production as well. But that's probably a different Charles Hamilton. Uh I low key wanna just skip to that song. I guess I'll nah, cause it ain't it ain't like I'm gonna start rocking with it. I I uh let's 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 just go to the last song. I wanna hear some 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 Charles Hamilton production. Yo, if you scared, get a dog, yo. Get a strong, like a like a Rottweiler or a boxer dog, not a, a Pomeranian dog. Rapid and wine, and bitch in the war zone. It's ace eye in the line, the witch in the wardrobe. I be just trying to warn folks. Some be going nut, whole lower torso in your horoscope. Give me a break, I'll be walking dead, give me a pace. Watch for walking dead, eating your brains. I rep the struggle, spite the subtle taste of card, boy, sand in the place to be by the grace of God. I step in the arena, bump and step in the arena. Green wave bears, no gray hair, it's a patina. Don't play fair, you can tell by how he shares pizza. The 6040 special from a porky Ebenezer, a belay slabonita. Brace for the brain rot, four eyes, corners like a marble in a maze box. Set your faces, obey or catch the vapors. A one two unscrew a player from his trainers. So when the players we do not get along, say what? So back up off again, say what? And if you scared, get a dog. So when the players we do not get along, say what? So back up off again, say what? And if you scared, get a dog. Yeah, the beat is definitely a Charles Hamilton beat. And it is fire. But these dudes with this lyrical spiritual shit. I can't get with it, bro. So I'ma pack that up. You know what I'm saying? And I'ma see if I can find that instrumental. Uh the, 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 <laughs> you know I'ma pack them boys up. Get a dog. Cause that instrumental is fire. Shout out to my nigga Charles Hamilton, bro. 
Oh, get at me, dog. Instrumental. The instrumental, the instrumental was fire. Let me see if it'll play out at the end. But that, but that whole lyrical, spiritual, individual in your swimming pool, that ain't my shit. Yeah, that beat, that beat fire though. supposed to be a, a tough dog. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stop with all of the lyrical spiritual. That shit is not getting paid in the whip. Y'all niggas better shut your lip because that shit is shit. <laughs> all right, bro. All right, man, this was a bit of a short one. Thank God it was a lot of duds. You know, I'm not finna I'm finna I'm not finna just let duds play out. You know what I'm saying? Like if I don't like if I don't like the first minute of a song, I'm not gonna like the song. So I let the I let the minute play out, and if I don't like it, pack it up. But um this was kind of a this was a, what was the first shit that we reacted to? Uh yeah, that shit was hard. That, you know, I'm gonna definitely listen to that um the, the New York guys, but Young Boy and uh ASAP Rock, y'all gotta get packed up, man. But uh yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video right here. A lot more coming soon. Searching for hidden rap gems, y'all already know that's about to come. You know what I'm saying? All that shit. But I'm gonna catch you guys on the next one. The rap dude signing. What is going on, guys? The Rap Dude back at you with a brand new video. And right about now, we are about to go ahead and continue checking out the new rap song series. Let's just go ahead and get right into it. Right about now, I'm looking at something that's very interesting right here. We got Now. I didn't even know that they still made these compilations i remember the nows back in the day when i was a kid it was it used to be hellas of them bro now r&b now rap now country now i say this is what i call music early 2000s hip-hop nelly hiding here dmx okay lean back shake your ass soldier on that bitch kid cutty all right it's pretty good it's a pretty good song it's got my nigga afro man on that bro Shout out to Afro Man, bro. 3 6. Lil John and Esau, boy. Oh, my. Common. The Light. That song that song did come out in the, the year 2000. That was off that one album. Okay. You know, we can't really listen to that because that's a lot of, you know. Shout out for that, though. But let's go ahead and just. Who is. What is this? Two Wolf Off Hall Rap. I have no idea. He got Capadonna from the Wu Tang as a feature. Styles P, Smoke Dizza, Rod Digger, Compton Menace. Damn. Hopefully it's fire, man. I, you know, I you know, like seeing stuff I've never heard of or never seen. I don't want to hear no intro. Let's go ahead and see. Serve the bass. <laughs> Go half on work and then take yours. <laughs> Still find shit like that funny. Still by any means, don't got no rap money. Okay. Might serve dude and rob him too. It's a war in the shot. Who give a fuck about down the two? Uh, Damn. You really trying to dodge a bit. You don't care how many months that Rihanna is. Uh. Sort of bass and I got it for cheap. My lick trying to sell the foams that he got on his feet. Okay, first and foremost. This is weird because Buddy is saying that he's from Chicago, but he's but he sound like a, a New York dude. He sound like um what's his name um Griselda, but um he's referencing a lot of pop culture. He's basically saying in the track like who cares about what's going on in the media when we got all this violence going on in Chicago? Because he had said a line in there. He said nigga fuck Donda too nigga. You know how many niggas is dying out here in Iraq type shit. 
But all right, man. Okay. So far, like I said, he sounds like a New York dude, but that don't mean there's nothing, anything bad about that. Like, I'm rocking with the track. Um, he got a nice flow. Like I said, his 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 bars, his bars are going crazy. So I'm liking it so far. My life change. Money showers every time it rains. Designer fabrics just to ease the pain. Toast the champagne to the brighter days. But you know we still got designs in the basement. Transition from the streets to the fame. I gotta make it. Can't let it weaken my game. I couldn't take it. Valley with the sways. I'm on track like A6. To touch a Billy go to shape shift. In the Panamera selling stack. That's the basics. All blue strips, no singles. Now you take your beat rolls. You can bet it. I got it from serving bases. Yeah. <laughs> All right, man, I'm rocking with this. Um, like I said, I really don't have any complaints at all. You know, it's a really like laid back track. I love laid back tracks. You know, I can put this in the background when I'm like, you know, streaming or gaming or what, you know, anything I do, you know, chilling, you know, just chilling, working on something. You know, I like chill music. Um, yeah, man, I'm gonna just go ahead and let the rest of it play out. I think we got a third verse. I'm Frank Thomas at the plate. The batting average is great. Shootouts in broad day to get home from third base. We was watching sports and the letting the cocaine dry. Stamped them bags, Ivan Drago. If he dies, he dies. I resurrected the dead. If he rise, he rise. You've been suspected of capping niggas. Lies is lies. If you represent Mick, I get my heart for niggas. Big shouts to Fuego and all my heart for niggas. Don't really care if you got money. The point is, we hate you. There's niggas on your block in the joint eating state food. I don't respect that. 360 degree is doing too much. I'm a Hellcat with your money praying for that base, nigga. I felt that. Okay, man, I'll go ahead and hit the like on that. You know what I'm saying? You know, so so far, so good. Let's go ahead and check out track three. He got a track with uh, Jaron Benson. I remember him. Uh, got some pretty good features on here. You know what I'm saying? Okay, let's check out track three, Lyrical Assault. It's got a bunch of motherfuckers on there. It ain't official unless it's too official. Niggas just got a death wish The bully, I got some problems I need addressing Some of you labels that owe me cheese I need to be collected Look how they flee when they see rap These niggas are pleading Beg for peace when you go check them I used to be that starving artist God forgive the devil's heart That's carving at your cartilage With a saw, bitch Bite off rappers' hands like the crawfish Let the vultures eat the carcass Bitch, I'm coming for the bosses Up in office Suffered a few losses Bounce back and beat the odds Nigga, regardless In regards to all the families The niggas that crossed them Might pay for the coffin did he fuck niggas just crawled in Might pop a couple bottles Dizzy said we gotta celebrate the small wins uh -huh. Tools on deck, hands on the hammer Nigga, I ain't talking ball peen uh -huh. I go hard for my offspring Strangle later, rapper with a drawstring Say goodnight to the bad guy They go feel it when I let the rifle blast Underneath the pale moonlight Come and dance with a fucking psychopath Red Ford when the title crash You know wave runners Ain't no shame putting for a chance Yo, what's his name again? Uh... Two wo off. I don't. How do, you, how do you say your name, bro? But if that was you on the first verse of this track, you're phenomenal, bro. The flow was just so sick. That was that 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 was amazing. And the instrumental, I'm really loving the instrumental. I'm just I'm just waiting to hear what everybody else bring on this track. Cause when I first clicked on it, like usually when it's like tracks like with a bunch of people on it, I'm kind of like put off. You know what I'm saying? But after that first performance, I think that was Buddy. Yo, 
the flow was the flow was sick right there and i like how it was infused with this instrumental that's kind of like it sound like some like joyful type you know what i'm saying yeah man but let's see what everybody else bringing up hopefully don't nobody ruin it because ha <laughs> you know what i'm saying like that's another thing about tracks that have a lot of people on it somebody gonna come with a with a whack ass verse that just, that just ruined it but i'm gonna just i'm gonna just let it keep playing then is this a Bible tactics advance on them with the right attack for me i'm back like devin hester end zone never lesser mastermind never need advice to complete a heist i'm ahead of lester cleaning out all the head suppression from here on out i ain't second guessing trying to be the one they read about 19 with a dream said if i ain't running game i'm a scheme of ralph and the bella check the whole squad i'll be retrieving the ball while my homies gonna get the rest of your dogs i'm caught in the traffic steadily swerving all of that bad is energy surges no i'm not mad them enemies cursed with falling in the back with hella detergent if he resurfaced pray he wash away the sins he dried off with the devil we can say you'll never see him till the Sonics play again Kick it out like Sean the Payton, I'ma take what's mine, they don't offer greatest Gotta go earn it yourself, do it for people I love and the people I lost So I keep the urn on my shelf, chasing the cream, I'm turning my wealth Patiently seeing how learning don't help Careful about where you go playing this fight for niggas, you might end up burning yourself They Damn. can't stop Hancock, even nah. with my hands locked The break nah. out would be like I was in the sandbox After the plan stops, I'm that hot What's these little steppers, the Sasquatch Used to be a part of the have-nots right. Nowadays I always have knots I mean, the whole cat got mad guap right. Made like 12 grand off the last drop Plus whatever was already in the stash spot Got more money coming in, bitch That's a damn lot I know they pocket watching my cash stops They act pock, it's all for an image like a backdrop Only animal on the outside like a mascot And hit with some shit that look like it's off a black op Or two to the head from this black block Make a nigga put it on you like a bad cop See we all authentic, yeah. been like that from start to finish Was ready to take off and get it soon as they said start your engine Already had thoughts of winning, cause taking the loss is sickening And all those hard beginnings change when we cross the ribbon, bitch I hustle everything, yes, I need all the digits Remember the customer's always right, anything else is wrong for business Everybody gotta die, and that's just the cost of living One day we all gonna take that loss, but while I'm here I'm a charge different Over lyrical killer with syllables, aiming with minimal filler it's the return of vanilla without all the ice and the flow still chiller. Jay Dilla will chop these beats, drop that heat like a Molotov meets. Whoever in all involved with Dream Pack of Procedures. Okay, man. So I just let the whole track rock out. Um, nobody came with a whack verse. I really, really love that track right there. You know, the instrumental. I love the like the breakdowns and and then it, and then it build back up. You know what I'm saying? I really, really, really do like that instrumental. And the rappers on that track, everybody did good. Wasn't no whack verse. Everybody came with their own, like, unique style flow. So, uh, yeah, man, hit the like on that. And, um, y'all already know what I do, man. If I like two tracks off of a project, I'm going to go ahead and listen to the whole thing. So, yeah, man, we got a dub right off top. Let's go ahead and just keep it going. What the hell is this? KD the Stranger, Live Evil, Revisited, Remixed, and Resurrected. I see Mad Child in there. I know who Mad Child is. I know who Slain is. Afu Ra. Um, Twisted Insane. Know who that is. Colt Calhoun. Strange Music Dude. Stevie Stone. Swizz. Uh, Buckshot. Low Key. Gruesome. Those horrorcore uh, horror rappers. King Iso. Damn, boy. Eshan? They got a song with Eshan. Who is this? KD the Stranger. <laughs> Mastermind. Damn. Killer C. Damn, boy. <laughs> he got some underground cats on there that I know, man. You already know Esham. That's my favorite rapper of all time. So I'ma have to, I'ma have to find the track with Esham. It's right there. Dope game. And then it said that it was remixed, remastered. So I'm guessing that this is an old project, but it's new to me. Uh, let's go ahead and check out. The first track, The Thing Returns, got a whole bunch of people on there, just like the last track. I see Twisted Insane in there. Definitely know who that is. And I'm interested, man. KD The Stranger, Live Evil. Hey, yo, what's up, man? It's Bizarre D12. Right now, you're listening to my own boy, KD The Stranger. Peace. 
coming up telling me that they cannot take any more of this Lyrical Ebola leaving you bleeding from every orifice Be sure to miss me with the bullshit People are looking and pointing and saying he is the cool prince He is the one that is killing them, leaving them dead on arrival His lyrics are self-evastating, he's murdering everything that he gets coming across And he's breaking them off and he's still elevating I'm making my moves majorly Better watch what you say to me, to say the least I cage a beast inside of me, so don't anger me Sick of be getting so devilish because I spit sick and this shit so A whole nother level of hell where misfits with slick wrists go Your fans are glued to me, truthfully, lyrical mutiny Boosting me on their shoulders, giving me everything but scrutiny Usually I'm calm, but they make me so angered And now bitch, it's on I'm a KD, the stranger from Indiana to Ukraine See, mob is too strange That's right, I'm different, but no, I'm not too changed I'm so unlike all of you, I'm in the lane of my own I'ma make it out the hood and make a lot of money doing hella dope songs I'ma kill him with the pin game, what I hit him with, they can't clone when I'm all over the world with a nigga when I tour, it's on Aye. They loving the way that I get it in When I spit it, hit the heart of many men And they women, they see that I'm about to win So they coming out, they wanna be a friend No deceiving him Reading them, all of them leaving mad, disappointed Believing them on and I'm joined with The hardest of artists, I'm shining regardless And I'm playing my part as a shark in the water So please get about it, but if you don't wanna get eaten Blood seeking for the martyrs, knee deep in Shit's creek, you peeps get beaten Getting ready for the weekend I've been going hard since Sunday We deep in, we do this, you foolish Aye. If you was thinking I never was gonna make it through, bitch the truth is, I'll prove this. What I do is spit. What I do is grit. You niggas ain't doing shit. And I'm different, unlike anybody. Yo, everybody know. Okay, first off, um, I'm not really feeling it. And the reason why is because um another another like rap style that I I mean I don't have a problem with it when certain people do it, but fast rap, uh chop flow. You know what I'm saying? Twisted Insane is on this song. And like, that's like literally his style. That's all he do is rap fast. But with him, I can I can bear it because he does it in such a unique way. So yeah. Um even with somebody like Twisted Insane, it gets repetitive. Like at times. When you listen to his like albums and stuff like it, like every song is like i mean it is what it is man but the first two dudes that rapped on this song they was doing it so like this will be something that i would not like go back to or, or bump so i'm gonna I'm just i'm gonna just let it play but um so far gets no plays in the ride man you know just gotta keep it real Sick, it's been predetermined yeah, I do it differently yeah. from hurt And keep them in search while I reach for the truth And I navigate parts of my deepest sermon Certainly murking me trees of a track But I'm breaking my back just to keep us immersed This underground hand, I'm not shit I'm tripping off cats when they see me in person Cause I don't be looking to acting like other rappers They're accustomed to I'm not MGK, bitch, I'm not Eminem I'm like, yeah, they will be there, I'm closer to you Deep in the cellar, just dwelling, no felon I sell it myself for a little advance I'm opportunistic, but not with the gimmicks I'm certain they get that they feel in the ram I'm hazardous Cause I'm a straight challenge, the effort with jammer Just killing the game When I say they're killing the game I mean killing this music that they're deep in my veins I need to maintain and release from my brain the negative energy keeping me strained. The negative energy throughout the game. When I'm feeling this rage, I release on the page. I'm different, yeah, different. I'm mad, maniacal, misfit. These other rappers, they can keep on the fame. Me, I'm alone, I can't help it, I'm distant. I rock the resistance, no assistance, cause I dismiss. All these rappers that's thick and they're making this ticking. I call them my patient to deal with these bitches. Bills and pile and poster, and now they're a puta, oblude, cause post all of a post apocalypse, swipe the pocket, and you troop, no, the prost apocat. Frost and a gamma, if Zemlo, Osipa, and the troop, and the crop, and the prost apocat, the log is bagami, if Zerkali, Bishu, the Persa, you was a raka. Huh, Ugara, you're not in me, you're a puppet, bank, level on the heart, you're a Играл, годы иду снова выверен шаг Я вижу их фарс, они тупо лишь фарс За тобой будто Джейсон, где не спеша Перебирай слова, тупо еле дыша Им выход один, по-любому бежать Ломаю ваш щит, потом его шаг Тут сразу не даю шанса Шрамы убивают, как муфаса Говорю фасы, псы рвут мясо Повод представиться не удался Что не текст, я хороню вас Это неизбежность, вы крутасов И здешний мой курс ясен Это нечто, я Курт Рассел The night with ease, hit him in the back of the Chevy, then I proceed to my next mission. Everyone looking at me like I'm worth taking a look in the mirror. You start with your bitch and calling me weird. Yes, I'm over. Uh, yeah, man. That's not gonna get no plays in the whip. Everybody on the track is just rapping fast. You know what I'm saying? All right, let me. Where the track with Eshan, man? You know, when it comes to when it comes to the type of rappers that I like, like if you're if you're, uh, um. Bar for bar type lyrical spiritual rapper. I would prefer you to rap slow 
So at least, you know what I'm saying, I can understand what you're saying. Not saying that I couldn't can't understand what they're saying. It's just the fast flow just seems like you're trying too hard. Maybe that. It just seems like you're just you you you're really really trying to to show people that you can rap. And I don't like that. Because Esham and Mastermind, they on this song. Like, those are not lyrical dudes, but they do have good punchlines. You know. And they don't they don't do the they don't do the fast rap shit. So that's why Esham can, you know, is, is, is my favorite rapper of all time because like He's just, he's just, he's just a good rhymer. You know, you don't need to do all that. But yeah, man, let's go ahead and check out Dope Game. I, I don't know who, I didn't know who KD the Stranger was in that. I mean, I don't even think it matters because <laughs> all, every, all, everybody was rapping the same on there. So. Devil in hell, boy. Package it, ship it like that, bitch. Flip it, trying to survive long enough to count every digit. This game ain't for lame. Training day, you about to get trained. Out here taking aim, I came to bang and slain. If you need to become a boss or pay the ultimate cost, so you can straight up get your head blew off in the dope game. Dope game, cocaine, slang the shit like no thing. Nigga, keep talking stupid, you have no brains. You ain't getting money fast, move to the slow lane. You wonder how I'm making a killing you don't know man dope man dope man that's what they be yelling when cocaine weed and speed is what you're selling and that's that strong steroid which you're smelling you wind up dead if your ass be telling hey, yeah, yeah. if you want to tweak then i got what you seek zombie space heads thieves and the freaks it's gonna be killed for the chase of the peace fuck the police i'ma stack on them a cheese i ain't losing no sleep over the trigger that i squeeze broken hearts misery your mother's mad at me bitch please best believe it ain't me it's another with the first piece for free this can is dandy, but you'll find it ain't sweet. Говори ты об этом пока рано. Пока раны не зажили, не помогут докторам, потому они не верили вербально. Покарал их долгий путь и ноги в кровь будто иду я по коралам, по канонам. Вашим я же дьявол страшен, тот и тот при котором в яму брошен, но не важно, ведь мой став так же вальяжен. Каждый куплет цветет однажды, но нет. Все их потуги скудные, при том оставшись в тьме. Не продаженных и пашу ради ваших монет. Столько видел задний двор похороненных мной заживо тел. Это скажут вам те, из которых каждый хотел честь. Uh, wow, bro. Uh, I'm like Esham and Mastermind opened the track. It really wasn't nothing too. It really, it really wasn't nothing spectacular. Um, like I said, I don't know who Katie the Stranger is, but whoever the third dude that rap after. Esham and Mastermind, nah. Like, when it comes to horrorcore rappers, I've you know I, I've listened, I listen to, I listen to quite a bit of horrorcore rappers, and um, I think it was like the last Searching for Hidden Rap Gems episode, but the horrorcore rapper that did that um, double album with Bizarre, very very unique. He had a lot of different styles. And he like he was singing, he was melanizing, he was he was rapping on you know, different flows and shit like that. Like just because you're a horrorcore rapper, you that you 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 still can't be like one dimensional because he has like the horrorcore style, but it was like just so generic. And the 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 fourth dude just ruined just completely ruined it for me. Well, I was it wasn't already something I was gonna bump, but you got. These dudes that's coming on the tracks that's rapping in different languages and with a fast flow, like no sir, man, no sir. So man, we just I'm gonna just go ahead, pack you up, cuh. And we're gonna move on. Alright. Okay, we got uh Raz the Ratchet, beautiful is that decadence? I think I pronounced that right. Uh, Raz the Ratchet, aka Raz of Ghetto Inmates, Grim Team. Have no idea what this is. Have no idea who this is. 
But we about to find out. Yeah, I might have to go ahead and pack KD the Stranger up. Here we got the whole album right here. You know, I don't care about intros. Let's get right into the track. Sore Thumb featuring What a Mess. All right, this is this is a this is a case of I like one aspect of the song, but I dislike the other aspect. And the aspect of this song that I do like was the verse and how the instrumental switched up and when, and when and when dude started rapping. What I don't like is the chorus. And I don't like that. I don't like that. I stick down like a sore thumb. Yeah. Nigga, what you mind? I don't like that, bro. <laughs> but, 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 like, like I said, the verse, it was, it, it was cool. But that part, I don't like. I, I, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't rock out to a, to a chorus like that. Oh, no, no shit. I don't care what you do. 40 clock is wrong. All right, man. So, uh, that track right there. If it wasn't for that chorus, it would have got added to the playlist, but that's, uh, nah. All right, let's see if he, you know what I'm saying, do better with Funny Things, track three. Let's go, man. <laughs> The instrumental on this track is fire. And the sample, I don't know, it sounds like it's a sample from like an old musical. Man, instrumental fire. Now the, now the guy that's rapping, what's his name? Uh, Beautiful, what's his name? Uh, Raz the Ratchet. He's, he's, he's okay. He's okay. Um... On a scale of one to ten, I give him a like. I give him a five point five. What's really saving it is this instrumental. I gotta be perfectly honest. Um, yeah, man. If I, I ain't gonna lie, bro. If I could just get the instrumentals, bro, I would. But I'm not saying like he's terrible. It's, it's just like generic. You know what I'm saying? It's not, bro. It's it's hard being a rapper, bro. It's 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 hard to stand out, because I've said it before. If you just if you're just like rapping, on some like on some like normal shit, bro, it's it's, it's gonna be hard, like, to convince me. It's like, oh man, this dude cold. Like you really gotta, you really gotta like stand out, and you really gotta be unique. You know what I'm saying? Like this dude just coming with some flowing b boy shit. You know what I'm saying? But it's just like, bro. Man, it's crazy because, like I said, the instrumental is fire, bro. And the, and the sample that's in there is heat. But I don't know if I could fully put it in my playlist. Yeah, man, that's a shame, bro. But that, that is really a shame because, uh, like I said, that instrumental is, is, is really, really, really good. But this dude, I'm just not, I'm just not really feeling... You know, I'm not feeling the flow. I'm not feeling the rapping, like, at all. It's, it's the rapping ain't snapping. But, uh, yeah, man, I'm going to go ahead and pack that up, too. It's a shame because the instrumental was heat. The instrumental in the second track was good, too. But, yeah, man, uh, packing you up. And uh, that's going to be it for this episode. Y'all already know, man, it ain't going to stop. I know I'll be taking some breaks here and there, but that's because, like, you know, these things, these, these episodes be... It'd be a lot for me to record, man. Setting up the, you know, nah, I ain't even finna go on all that. But, man, just be on the lookout for more, man. I'm finna just keep it going. You know what I'm saying? Checking out new rap songs. Searching for here, rap gems. That's gonna be the main thing that's gonna be on this channel. As far as, like, topics and all that stuff, I'm gonna start uploading those to my, um, my Gully Boy 2 channel. 
but for this one, I just I just really wanted to be searching for hidden rap gems and uh, checking out new songs. But yeah, man, I'm gonna catch you guys on the next video. Rap dude, signing out.